We are finally at the reservoir here on Kauai where you can get peacock bass. There's lots of slurping going on too. On the way walking out here, I've seen six or seven big slurps and there's tons of action everywhere. I see a fish is right there. Oh, those look like peacocks right there. All right, so let's get on it. Let's catch us a peacock bass. All right, if you haven't already, please subscribe. This is a good chance. You don't wanna miss out, right? Okay, let's get them. So I forgot I needed to get a fishing license. So I had to run back to the moped and get my credit card and uh, buy a fishing license and screenshot the, the purchase. Hopefully that will work. It says it must print it out and hold a copy. So fuck, I hope I'm okay. I don't want to get no crazy fine. I did just pay $11 for two days. Or it says for seven days, but I'm only be here for two more days. But I'll be coming here more. The coast is too crazy to fish, have any luck. Uh, it's just mud washing up everywhere. All right, let's get ready. Let's get us a peacock bass from Kauai. All right, so what should we hit these fools with? Um, something top water, like a frog. There is a lot of, there was a bunch of frogs tripping when I first got here, but I was talking and they stopped. Yeah, we'll try my little frog here. Little frog. It's a big ass frog. Let's do a normal clinch knot. We don't need anything special. We don't need a loop knot or nothing with this top water. But if we switch to a fish pattern, we will do that. We'll put on glasses just so we don't lose an eyeball. It's always a good idea, right? Not keeping all our eyes. I'm fond of vision. So there is a river that runs into this and then drains off the other side over there. We're gonna try to mess around with the edge of it. The muddy water coming through the river. Maybe they're sitting right there hunting. That's where we see a little bit of action. Right there. You know what? I'm gonna this out. I'm trying to wear no jacket. <laughs> Ooh, that fly is nice. I like it. I like it, like it. Oh yeah, nine weight, baby. That's gonna wear me out fast. I am not really getting out there. I gotta find a place where I can stand at water level. I think I'm gonna do it over there. We're gonna move spots and walk down here. We're gonna get at water level. I should have asked that gentleman uh, the other day when I talked to him and he said he caught a nice one out here. He said like a six, seven pound one. Which is... Oh, look at that. Look at all that action right there. I should throw out there, huh? I should try at least. Oh, jeez. This water is exploding over here. Jeez, I don't know if they're doing that because they see me or what. Oh, it's muddy. My wife's gonna be thrashed. <laughs> All right. We may switch also to a uh, um, spinning rod and just cast flies way out there with it using the whipping method. <laughs> yeah, this is a waste of the energy. I doubt that old man that was fishing here was doing this. He had an eight weight. Hi. Hello. What's up, little piggies? Little wild piggies? What you doing? Little leg sniffer? Oh, hello. 
Hey, don't nip me. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? It's like nipping me. Hey, come on, come on. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> He did that for us too. Oh, uh, okay. Okay. Hi. Hi. Hey. You protecting us now? All uh, right, maybe. Want to call him? <laughs> Tommy. 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 Grab that net. Grab that net over here. He's trying to attack me. <laughs> He's biting me. He's nipping us. Tommy. Hey, what are you doing, bud? All right. What are you doing? <laughs> Jeez, oh, don't get caught up on my line. Oh, I didn't mean to hit you. <laughs> That's a little crazy. <laughs> Not every day you have something like that. First I thought he was just nuzzling me, then I got nipped a few times. I was like, wait a minute, what? Like, no. <laughs> <laughs> I got attacked by a little baby wild pig. Now that pig's messing with another guy. <laughs> He's doing the same thing. He's nudging him. Nipping at his legs. <laughs> He's hitting him with his fishing pole. <laughs> oh, jeez. Funny, funny, funny. All right. We're going to get the spinning rod set up. Seeing I can't cast as far as I think I need to. Oh shoot, there we go, tilapia, I believe. <laughs> well, that's my first tilapia I've ever caught. Now I think that's too big for bait, so we're gonna let that guy go. I'm pretty sure that's a tilapia. I think you can eat them. Well, I mean, usually you can eat tilapia. What's up, little buddy? I'm not sure if tilapia are like ground feeders or whatever, mud feeders, but there's something stirring up mud and that's about where I caught that first tilapia is where the mud's being stirred up. Like you'll see a puff of uh, really red mud come up, kind of like where a carp would be feeding. Oh yeah, that's gross. Oh, look at all that stuff scurrying. Bite? Ah, uh, nothing. Had a bite though. They just, they just nip the tail, I'm assuming. Little short strikes. It does have a pretty long tail. Let's do another cast over there. Let's see if we can make it happen. Seeing something's willing to bite over there. See all that action? I don't know if they're just moving because I'm casting. I don't know what the heck they'd be moving from. The shadow flying over? The thing doesn't weigh very much, or look, doesn't have much of a shadow. Oh, nothing that time. Come on now. Oh, there we go. There's a hit. Another hit, come on. I think I'm just getting short struck here. One more time here. Come on, baby. Get one of these kawaii bass. Oh, we lined up with something big. All right, let's bring it through where they were. Let's 
try casting over here again. We haven't cast over here or seen any action over here. But maybe we can get them riled up. Oh, they're riled up for sure. <laughs> All right. I got hits on a little bit slower retrieve, so we're going to slow it down a little bit. Come on now. Come on now. You know you want it. They must be right on the surface, these fish, because they're scurrying when they, scurrying, they're taking off when they, when I cast before it hits the water even. So they, they must be seeing the shadow fly over, All right? That's my guess. One more cast over here. That's a little risky, but. <laughs> to catch a lizard here but they are very fast and very worry wary so we're gonna do a little noose lizard noose and see if we can get one It's an anole, some kind of anole species. I wonder if it's a Cuban. No, it's not a Cuban anole. We're on the wrong side of the ocean. Come on, guy. <laughs> this is not. There we go. We got him. Oh, he got off. What? We had him too. There's another little one right here. He's already lost his tail. Let's see if he'll let us catch him. We almost had that one. Well, we did have him. He just slipped out somehow. Maybe my noose is a little bit fierce. I'm used to doing it with grass too. It's a little bit different. This guy's been super wary. He hasn't let me down. get anywhere near him, so... Got him. Oh, we got away. <laughs> okay, this noose isn't any good. Uh, we'll definitely do. Look at this fancy stuff. Wristband. Boop. What, what? Wristband entry, baby. 